Would you say Mr. Foster suffers from any medical illness? In my professional opinion, no, based on his medical records. But my field is psychiatry. So from the perspective of general psychiatry, uh, would you say that sleepwalking is a neurological disease? No. Is it a result of mental illness? No. I would not call sleepwalking a disease of the mind. Could it be premeditated? What do you mean? Is there any evidence someone could plan an act while awake and then carry it out in their sleep? Program the mind. No, absolutely not. We cannot directly control our thought patterns while we're asleep as we can when we're awake. So if Mr. Foster was indeed sleepwalking, there could be no intent to commit murder. Well, in the waking state, we are capable of volition. In layman's terms, doctor, please. We're able to plan and complete premeditated acts while we're awake. But we're incapable of volition while asleep. Or say, in the defendant's case, sleepwalking. Is that correct? Correct. In all the sleep studies, there is no evidence that volition occurs during sleepwalking. Zero evidence. Zero evidence, doctor. In, would you say, hundreds of investigations? Thousands even.